in a world where every franchise has at least one dud. Never leave the cave without it. John Wick will once again pull off the impossible in an excellent fourth film. So if it wasn't clear by now, we're never gonna let this franchise stop. Have you given any thought to where this ends? Nope, Keanu's gonna be 80 and we'll watch him snap necks in a tactical diaper. John Wick, Chapter 4. Chapter 3 ended with John growling the word, Yeah, yeah. Now, pick up exactly where he left off. Yeah, 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 yeah. For another wall-to-wall -wall banger of an action film that's once again about trying to leave the assassin world because he clicked I agree without reading the terms and conditions. In a thrill ride that runs for just two hours and 49 minutes. Because if your wig goes hard for a full three hours, you have to seek medical attention. Also, everyone's wearing a vibranium suit this time, so it takes 10 shots to drop a single goon. John Wick is back, and with every assassin on his tail, he can travel from New York to Osaka to Berlin to Paris without incident. But once he's teleported to his next fighting game stage, oh boy, look the f out. He's determined to let anything except his words do the talking. Probably because he's got CTE so bad, he can't string together a full sentence. As this human throw pillow takes an endless stream of physical punishment and personal criticism. My father is dead because of you. Because of you, I had to kneel in front of the man who murdered my father. But I didn't kill Koji. You did, John. Just because of his never-ending quest to kill everyone on planet Earth. No one, not even you, can kill everyone. Counterpoint? Yes, he clearly can. <laughs> Watch John set his sights on the Marquis, yet another overmatched European fancy boy, who you just know is evil because he hangs out next to a scale model of a city and only villains get to do that. John will also cross paths with his old friend Kane and continue running up the scoreboard against the hearing and visually impaired. Donnie Yen shines in another blind role because it would be straight up unfair to let him fight if he could actually see. <laughs> They'll tangle with the tracker, a guy who's hunting John because he's too broke to upgrade his phone. Watch in dismay as he spends the film sniping from the edge of the map like a f***ing camper. Plus thrill at the return of Ian McShane's Winston and recoil at the debut of Ian McShane's Winston's new bleached teeth. Whoa, the veneers or the tanning bed? One of them's gotta go. Forget the characters. This is all about the action. And man, do they deliver. Featuring some good old fashioned horseplay. The one that's just like my Japanese animes. <laughs> The one that confirms they turned off car damage. The one where they're just playing Hotline Miami. The one where the stunt guys get to really earn their paycheck. And the one where they all sit down to play the assassin version of Magic the Gathering. Blades. Pistols. Don't you guys have to, like, tap land first or something? Sorry, it's always looked way too boring to learn. After killing roughly 10,000 goons over the last three films, watch John start to take his toll on the global assassin industry, forcing them to inflate the wages. The lottery just went up. Hire poorly trained inexperienced scabs. and churn out wave after wave of trainees with a maybe 5% shot at getting through their first shift alive, to the point where they're so desperate for new hires, they have to advertise on FM radio. This golden hit goes out to you, Mr. Wick. Come on now, people. We're gonna have to do a lot better. Also enter the code Warriors Ripoff at checkout to receive 20% off your next funeral. 
So return to the relentless franchise that's got that dog in it. Because now that you've seen John Wick avenge a dog, adopt a dog, and team up with a dog, enjoy this new spin where he fights a dog, <laughs> then befriends a dog. Because at the beginning, they killed his dog, dog. Damn, dog. R.I.P. to a real one. Starring Ted Theodore Shogun, Winston Checks Out, Larry the Table Guy, another Skarsgård? You're in your element, Donnie. It has indeed been an honor, my friend. Now, fellas, I want a clean duel. I've got a lot of money writing on this. The Notebook. Get over here! And have a pleasant stay. South American Ninja Warrior, The Adkins Diet, and Stairs. Wick, Chapter 4, Parabellum 2. You know, you may think it's weird so many people are still dancing, but this is actually the least disturbing thing that happens in a German nightclub. Hey, screen junkies. We gathered experts in law, psychology, and firearms to analyze how John Wick would fare in the real world. There's not anything in the law right now about an extra penalty for death by library book. Click the box on the right to watch now. I refuse to read these requests if you don't say please. My voice is how it feels to chew five gum. Rock, paper, scissors, grenade launcher. One, two, three, four. I declare a thumb war.